The content within this video is not suitable for children. Viewer discretion is advised. doing. Hope he hasn't forgotten about little me. I often wonder what my purpose is. I go from town to town and live out my mundane life. Eat a little here. Steal a little there. Not like I can't have a good life. I just choose not to. I was someone else back then. Someone I'm not proud of. Now, here I am. I wish I could take it back. Take back all the things I did. Take back all the wrongs I committed. Take back the lives I took. Take back the people I hurt. But there's no point in dwelling on the past. The future is what will live on, and I must move with it. Someday, I'll pay back what I've done. But until then, here's hoping I'll make it to that day. I'm sorry, Master. I wish I controlled myself better. I hope you'll be proud of me one day. here somewhere. Another guild hall is destroyed and... Oh. I never saw the damages. Huh. Should I really even be doing this? God damn it. I know someone's gonna get pissed off, but I don't know if I have a choice. Not like they need the contracts anyways. <laughs> Gotta be slow. I don't think they're here anyways. Whatever's left of their guild, I can more than likely take. Huh. Fire. That's that's nice. That's real nice. I don't understand why there's fire here. Just creep in, hope no one's here. This place is completely unstable. What even happened here? There's something in the news about it. It's an entire mess. There's just random stuff. I. Why, why does he need a sh ship's helm? Shit. Nobody needs a ship's helm. Why are they here? But it's going in his junk anyway. We could be pirates with it. Wouldn't you want to be a pirate? That sounds cool. Um. I, I tried the pirating life once. It didn't quite work out. Wasn't too good. I kept giving myself away. Those guys are strange. I gotta have something around here, though. Gnomes. Yeah. And, uh... God damn it. What? what, what, what? Yeah. I'm just so confused. They... they... Can we... Can we... There's a lot of... useless stuff. It's broken. It's just like everything else around here. Ah, uh, well, that... Wait. Did you see Did something? You... Shit. I thought I saw something blue. Shit, shit, shit. I thought I Is saw something... Is anyone there? 
blue. Nothing Maybe else. not. Maybe it was rats. Maybe. This place is a mess. Yeah, it's a little filthy, yeah. Could try and cause it the cleanest things being those lights. Did you? I thought I saw something else. I don't. I can't get out of. Mm. I hope it is Trapped. just rats. Shit. Um. Hello. Hello. Uh. Hey. I. Oh. Here. Uh. Hello. I don't Where mean are any you? harm. I'm just trying to find. Uh, some food right now. Food? Ah, uh, you've come to the wrong place, buddy. Wait, um, wait. We have extra cookies. Here. Oh. You kept those? I uh, had a couple left. Christ, you didn't need them all. Thanks. Uh, what's your name, stranger? Um, it, it, Mitch. Mitch? Yes. That's a beautiful name. Almost as beautiful as you. Uh, that's... Funny. Okay. Uh, <laughs> It's nice. I'm just, uh... Thanks. <clears throat> what, uh... What you doing here, Mitch? Other than searching for food. Uh... You lost? Just... I thought this place was abandoned. Didn't know the guild... Are you guys guild members? I... Yeah, we're from Grimshade. Oh. Two um, of the newest members. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, huh. Uh, I'm just trying to find a place to stay for a bit. It's cold. And... Cold? Well, I mean... There is there is the new building. Could, could... Would Alamos be okay with it? I'm not sure. He might murder us. If he I doesn't, don't... Viper might. I don't want to be on either of their bad sides. They're both mm. kind of scary. Um, especially if I. I'll just, I'll, I'll just find, I'll just, you know, sleep somewhere around here. Oh, I mean, you can take any one of these tents. Um, maybe not that one. Uh, Colin slept in that one, and it's kind of gross. I'll take your word for it. Uh, but like, what? Seriously, man, you're all right. I'm like, fine. I just wasn't expecting to see people here, you know, well, uh, in a building like this. We're on cleanup duty, so, uh... It's not much yeah. to clean up. I said uh, bulldoze the whole thing. Ah, oh, we would, but Colin's sentimental. About what? They all the are. rubble? Is there stuff yeah. hidden here, maybe? Well, I mean, this used to be the old Grimshade building. He has memories of it. Of it. Mm. I mean... I'm just wondering, sorry. Uh, probably too personal. <laughs> I mean, even if there were treasures, I'm sure they've been taken. Yeah, we wouldn't know anything about them anyways. Okay, uh... Sorry, um, I'll just try to find a place over here or something. Yeah, Sleep. no problem. Um, look, I can't stay here for long. My name is not Mitch. My name's not Mitch. Why would it be Mitch? Okay, okay, okay. Um, it's gotta be something amongst the rubble here. Some. What is that? What is that? Oh. Huh. That's interesting. Old family heirloom stolen. Please re return to me. I need it. Could be useful. Hmm. Cat. Catherine. Interesting name. I'm gonna question it though. Hmm, could provide something. Could not. What? Sir? What? That. Yes? you back so quickly. Uh, sorry, I was just... D don't mind it, I'm just... Looking around a bit, you know, trying to find the right place to lie, to... 
make a rubble pillow. Right. Um, there are the tents. I don't know if I necessarily want to sleep in the tents. I don't want to seem like a. You know, I'll just, I'll just, I'll just get out of your hairs and just, you know, just. Well, I mean, if you need somewhere to stay, we can maybe let you stay in the guild hall. I, yeah, I'm fine. I'm, I'm fine. Don't worry about it. I'm just, you know, just, I'm just trying to find a place. That's it, really. Uh, oh, okay. If you're I, sure. Yeah, hundred percent, hundred percent. Just gonna. Well, in that case, uh, don't be a stranger. I uh, mean, yeah. of course, of course. A handsome man such as yourself doesn't deserve to be living like this. I'm not uh, okay. I'm not gonna. <sighs> Why do I wink? <sighs> okay, I think those two don't even know. I hope they don't remember my face. I shouldn't. I should not know what I look like, anyways. I don't know if I can make it from this angle. Okay. Okay. Fine for now. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. I can't believe that worked. Sort of. I got my face spotted. And I, no, he probably won't. Hmm. No, and I think about a Grimshade. They're probably not even accepting, uh, you know, jobs right now. Why would they be? They don't have a guild hall. Too busy reconstructing it. They won't even notice that it's took this of all things. Catherine, Catherine. All right. Okay. I should should head home. I'm gonna head home. Got the contract, made it back home. Home. Home, quote unquote, huh? It's not really in my house, is it? It's just, it's not really a home. It's just the, it's just this corner that Betty lets me sleep on when she doesn't ask me to sleep in her house. I don't want to be that guy. All right. <sighs> okay, what about this letter, though? Catherine. Family heirloom. Stolen. It's basically lost and found. All right. Bunch of thugs. This was sent out months ago. Literally months ago. What the fuck? <laughs> well, this might have been when Grimshade fell apart. Though I'm not sure if she's content with that. Oh, uh, she, yeah, she probably wants this damn thing done anyway. She's probably willing to pay a hefty fine or reward. Now, the question is where the hell these gang members are? Or who they are, really? I could probably just try looking around here. There's a bunch of gangs around the place, anyways. Hmm. Could work. No. Could be the hammer. Hmm. No. Maybe. I'm not sure. Best not to dwell, dwell with them. Could be just random thugging or mugging. Which gang caused it, though? <sighs> hmm? Oh, hello, dear. I was just coming to check on you. Uh, hey, hey Betty. I haven't seen you in a long time. Come on in. How when did you last eat, dear? You look thin. Come on in. Uh, you know, that's the fancy because you, know, you kept going on about how you don't have the best vision. Well, I can tell from a distance that you sound thin. Now take a seat. You can sit on the couch. You want some cookies? I just baked some cookies. Uh, sure, Betty. <clears throat> All right, let me get you some cookies then. All righty. Now, how are you doing, dear? How uh, have you been? I'm fine, Betty. Uh, I uh, found a found a job. Oh, really? That's very good. I'm so happy for you. Yeah. Uh, I'm uh, glad you're turning life around. Yeah. Uh, so, how are you doing? I know I haven't really been here for a while. Oh, I've been doing just fine. 
it gets a bit lonely here, but that's not your problem, I mean, I can tell. But I'm just glad you turned your lap around. I've just been, you know, doing my own thing here, just knitting, uh, I spending know. time. He's, uh, I know it gets hard sometimes, Betty, I I'm sorry. Oh, it's all right. I know I'm not gonna live forever either. I'm, we're all human after all. We're all gonna go eventually. Of course, of course. Um, so what you doing though? Smells like oh. you're about to cook something. Oh yes, I figured, you know, might as well, since you're here, make you something nice to eat. Uh, you don't really have to, Betty. I oh, I insist, I insist. You know I like cooking. I know, but you don't, I don't want to be like, you know, that guy, just... Coming, what guy? Me coming to you for food and help only when I need it. That kind of oh, it's alright if you need to. I know you don't want to be like that, but you're down on your luck right now, honey. So, if I can help you get back on your feet and feel better about yourself, then I'm glad to help you. Besides, you're very kind to me, and you are, you know, you do spend time with me, so... The very fact you don't want to be that guy shows that you aren't that guy. <laughs> Alright. Um, so, um... About my job thing, um... Oh, yes, tell me about it. Everything's cooking, so I'll just give it a minute. Um, I, I need to meet with... Clients. Ooh! Yeah, it's settled disputes, basically. Well, that's wonderful to hear, hon. Just wonderful. Sounds like you'd be perfect for that kind of job. I, I hope. It's... I'm not sure if demanding would be the word. It's... something. <laughs> well, I know you'll do your best with whatever you get. Now, are you sure you don't want me to change those bandages on you? I'm, you've been wearing them for like a long time since I first they're not. They're not you. bloody or anything. Oh, better. I know, but I just I want to make sure that you aren't getting hurt or anything. I'm quite, I'm quite certain, Betty. All right, all right. I just had to ask. Of Are course. you excited about this job? I mean, a little. I've never really done something like this before. Oh, I get it. It's very exciting. You know, when Harold was around, he was always excited about when he was finding new projects to work on, especially as a young man. He did a lot of carpentry work. <laughs> yeah. So. Oh, I'm sorry I'm rambling about no, it. No, no, it's okay. You can, you can. I'm not going to stop you. Oh, okay. Well, you know, we weren't old all the time. He was a young man. He could, you know, move around and, you know, not need me to help him out of bed every morning. But, you know, he, he used to be excited about making projects. And when he had to retire, he was so upset over it. But he was old, so. I mean, 80's a pretty old age to retire at. Oh, yes. He insisted to keep working to provide for me. And when he retired, I swore to him he wouldn't have to work a day more in his life. I would do everything for him. And I did. So I, he was very comfortable. I know. <laughs> uh, I, I Probably stupid to say, you know, after saying it for like a year. Uh, thank you for letting me sleep in your garden front. Whatever. Oh, if you want to, you can sleep on the couch if you'd like. I would let you sleep no, no, in a bedroom, no, no. but I don't have another bedroom. That's fine. I, I'm fine with what I have right now. All right, but if it gets cold out there, you better you best know that I'm gonna insist uh, you come in. Uh, of course, Betty. I, I promise I'll come in if when winter comes. Thank you, dear. That that was that that makes me feel better. If I need it. Oh, I mean, if you need it, of course. I'm sure you're going to be back on your feet in no time. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. That's a lot of pressure to put on you. It's it's fine. It's it's fine. Just yeah. Uh, I, Betty, I, not to sound rude, but did you just start cooking that when I got in here? Yes. <laughs> you don't really make much for yourself nowadays. Oh, I used to make a lot of food when Harold was around. Not anymore. <laughs> yeah. I just make one meal for me myself, like, you know, you know, to last me through the whole day or maybe the week. But I like cooking and I like baking, so I like, you know, giving food away. Yeah. I'm sorry, that sounds sad. <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. Um, I might be working with I, I, I sorry um I made a couple friends oh 
really? That's wonderful to hear. Yeah, um... They're a little high up, but... Yeah. Well, if you ever want, I can. If you want to bring them by, and I can make them some I, cookies or pie or cake, some of them, I'm win them over for you. Sure, I'll, I'll I'll keep it in mind, Betty. All right, all uh, right. Or do you want me to eat the food now, or? Oh yes, take a seat. The food's all ready now. I I, I mean, like I could probably I should probably get going to the. Oh, I insist you eat before you go, young man. I can tell from a distance you're thin. So. Come on, and get bit. Go, go, go. Take a seat. All right, all right, fine. Wonderful. Let me just get food. <laughs> Thank you, Betty. Oh, anything for you, dear. <sighs> About time I came here. She waited yet another day. About two months, and that's a long time to wait for job order. Yeah. Hold on, is this... Huh. Brian's ass. Neat. Visit here later, I guess. I have a job to do. I have a job to do. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, I kind of stole it. Not sure if it'd be really worth it. But, who knows. Job's a job at the end of the day. Might as well see what goes on. It's a pretty big house for a family. Can I help you? Uh, yes, ma'am. Uh, are you Catherine? Y yes. What, what can I do for you? I'm from Grimshade. I'm here about a, a job order. Oh, f yes. I Come on in. Thank you. Um, I, I, I read, uh, re read the report. It said something about a family heirloom. Yes, my, my grandmother's ring. It was her wedding band. It, it, it was, it, you know, it's 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 really important to me. I, uh, of course, I don't really have of course, much of course. to remember her by. I'm just wondering, do you happen to know anything about what happened? Like where where uh, where did you where did you lose the ring exactly? Um, the south of town, south of the city. Um. A small alleyway. He took me there and demanded I give him my valuables, and he took my ring. Okay. Hmm. All right. Um. Do you happen to know what he looked like? Well, obviously. What do you have like? You know. What did he look like? Sorry. Like um. You know, brown hair. Uh, Bluish shirt. I, I don't know. White. Yeah. All right. Um. He didn't have any Insignias? markings on him. No. None of the local none, gangs. None. Mm -mm. It's just a common street thug. All right. That makes my job a little easier and harder. Okay. Um, ma'am, this ring of yours. I understand it's gonna. I understand it's very valuable to you, yes? Yes. Okay. I'm gonna try my best to find this ring and give it back to you. Thank you very much. Is... It's a, it, I, I really miss it. Is there a reward for doing this? Of course there is, yes. Okay. I'll, I'll get to that right away, ma'am. Thank you very much. I really appreciate all of your help. My name is... Mitch. It's Mitch. Well, thank you very much, Mitch. No problem. God damn, she is hot. <sighs> Am I just gonna go by the name Mitch now? <laughs> Seems real stupid. <sighs> oh, what am I talking about? I shouldn't give them my name yet. If I do, then they could probably trace it back to me and find jazz flurry and probably destroy the carnival and then they blame me for that south of town though that's near where i live alleyways galore over there could try searching there first would be the most difficult thing in the world however 
not gonna be easy to find somebody that looks like that. Not easy at all. She's loaded though. Rich as all hell. I'm surprised by that. <laughs> You'd think she'd hire somebody to get her. Get them. You know, like a independent group, not a guild. And wait two months. It, she's probably just gonna want to bother anyone. I'll just do this. I'll just do this. Start searching now while I'm at it. Two months late. But I'll take it. I swear if it's them. Hey sister, ready to get going to the party? Oh, I'm sorry, but I don't think I can. What? Why not? Well, I met this guy, and I think he and I really hit it off. Oh, looks like someone got a little boy toy. Is he cute? Well, I think so, but he and I are going to be going on a date. Oh, you go get it, girl. Yeah, go get him, but we'll be at the party. Good luck with your little date, girl. Thank you, girls. I fucking hate them.